half-time whistle approached and the visitors actually went in at the break leading as Ben Morgan crashed over for his first try in cherry and white colours. But in direct reply, Sione Calamafoni fed Ben Morgan and the England number eight strode away powerfully for Gloucester's third try, prompting dreams of a potential bonus point fourth. Quick ball for Gloucester, Morgan again for Gloucester. Chapman, quick ball for Morgan, there are so many soft shoulders out there at the moment. Ben Morgan is making the most of all of them. And he has a hat-trick for the night. He runs so well, back against the grain, just bounces through one. The little half-end, and at that point, he knows he's there. But it's here with Morgan! He's very close, and he's got it down! And that might just do it for Gloucester! Good popped on that side, boy, that's Ben Morgan! It's a clear counter! Ben Morgan then showed what England might be missing when he forced his way over just before the half hour mark. Purdy, try and score up about this time last weekend. Ben Morgan strides away from the tacklers. Can anybody stop the England number eight? He reaches out, drops the ball down. I think Maris Matreya will go up to Conor Damasco just to check this. Tries given. This is Marshall and this is Morgan and it is the perfect Gloucester start in the semi-final. Oh, through the hands and into heaven for Gloucester. The league, but in a West Country derby when you can get... Oh, hang on, here's Reece Samet, he's on a hat-trick. Away to Morgan. And what it's taken, 52 seconds. 52 seconds of the second half for Bath's defence to be once again shredded by Gloucester, it's becoming embarrassing. And um, only James Forrester has scored more tries as a Gloucester forward these days in the Premiership than, uh, than Ben Morgan.